Sometimes the best birthday presents are the ones we give ourselves. East Carter grad and Alabama softball pitcher Montana Fouts tossed a perfect game on one of the biggest days of her life in one of the biggest games of her life. While you were sleeping, Fouts made some pretty big history. The game ended around 1230 this morning and you should have stayed up for this one. It was 21 up and 21 down for the new 21 year old. The former Charleston resident was brilliant in the circle. Fouts struck out 14 batters in a complete game 6-0 win over UCLA. Montana's dad, Tim Fouts, in the stands for this one and loved what his daughter did in the circle. The Grayson product fanned the first two batters in the seventh inning before getting Aliyah Jordan to fly out to the left to secure the perfect game for the former Lady Raider. Fouts says she was not thinking about being perfect, rather just handling UCLA's lineup one batter at a time. I was just locked in each pitch because I knew that one swing away, they have momentum. They're a great hitting team, um, great pitching staff. I mean, we respect them so much. So I think Murph says all the time, respect your opponents. And tonight, for me, I think that that just meant locking in pitch by pitch just because I knew the game could get away in a heartbeat. The Tide are off tonight, but we'll play tomorrow afternoon at 3.30. Alabama will face the winner of the Oklahoma, Oklahoma State FSU matchup. That game started less than an hour ago. Let's take a closer look at Fouts' fantastic performance in the shutout win over UCLA. The former Lady Raiders star went seven innings strong, picking up the complete game victory. She fanned 14 Bruins and kept UCLA off the base path, all while tossing a perfect game. It's a moment she'll always remember, and so will the history books. It's just the fifth perfect game in the history of the Women's College World Series.